Hello everyone, this is Khalil from NCS Training Center. Uh, we talked already in part number one about uh, the setup and assign of reminder terms and we discussed that uh, the first step will be to create reminder terms and then the second step would be to work with the levels for each reminder and we are talking about level one that it has grace period for five days which means after the invoice is being laid for five days after the due date of the invoice of the posted invoice after five days of the due date of the posted invoice then level number one will be issued or will be kicked in for the customers and then after one month of level number one issued reminder then level two of reminders will be issued or kicked in for the customers and then after one month of level number two then level number three will be issued and you see each level has its own additional fees five dollars ten dollars fifteen dollars and we can put additional fee per line amount if we need and the additional fee calculation will be fixed we can change it to variable as well okay so the step after will be to define the text for each level for example here for level one i want to put a beginning text or i want to put an ending text for level two i want to put different beginning text and different ending text for example here i am defining here ending text for level one that it will say when we issue the reminder please remit your payment of seven percent what is the seven percent it's a variable that we can check we can put here seven percent four percent so this seven percent it will bring the invoice the invoice amount or the total amount of the invoice that they have to pay with the reminder and the last step will be to issue the reminder terms codes on the customer card to assign the reminder terms code on the customer card i will show you all of this in the application so here if i am in cross canada i will look first for reminder terms this is the reminder terms and Anna, you have to create as i mentioned to you before that you have to create different reminder term for each language for example i want to create english reminder term english reminders for my english customers and i put here english any description that i want reminder and the maximum number of reminder i will leave it as zero but after that i will check the levels so i have to create a level number one as i mentioned i can put the five days here and i don't need to put a due date calculation and i'll create number level number two it will be issued after one month of finishing level number one and i don't need to put uh, due date calculation it's not mandatory to put it it's up to you and the additional fee for for number one will be five dollars or five pounds depends on the local currency that you are using so this will be five pounds or ten dollars or ten pounds and fifteen dollars and the step after will be to define the text as i mentioned that there is a text from navigate for each level 
I will go to navigate and then I will define the beginning text. Dear customer. You know, this is the beginning text. And then uh, the ending text will be from navigate again level ending text and it will be please remit remit payment of seven percent what does it mean seven percent it means the total of the invoice this is a variable seven percent you can check the different variables that can be used in this case to us as soon as possible and here you can sign for example or you can put ncs 